Climate change impacts water access. Climate change is a phenomenon of increasing average air temperatures near the surface of Earth over the past one to two centuries. The water cycle is part of our everyday lives, but climate change may have dire consequences for everyday water access. The main climate change consequences related to water resources are increase in temperature, shifts in precipitation patterns and snow cover, and a likely increase in the frequency of flooding droughts. It may change the seasonal variation in river flow. It tends to increase the intensity of rainfall. There may be an increase in the occurrence of flooding due to heavy rainfall events. Climate change has already affected water access for people around the world causing more severe droughts and floods. Increasing global temperatures are one of the main contributors to this problem. Climate change impacts the water cycle by influencing when, where and how much precipitation falls. It also leads to more severe weather events over time. Increasing global temperatures cause water to evaporate in larger amounts which may lead to higher levels of atmospheric water vapor and more frequent, heavy and intense rains in the coming years. Climate scientists predict that the shift may lead to more floods since more water will fall than vegetation and soil can observe. The remaining water or runoff drains into nearby waterways, picking up contaminants like fertilizers on the way. Excess runoff eventually travels to larger bodies of water like lakes, estuaries, and the ocean, polluting the water supplies and limiting water access for humans and ecosystems. When fertilizers from farming wash into lakes and the ocean, they might promote the rapid growth of algae. These resulting algal blooms clog coasts and waterways with cloud of green, blue-green, red, or brown algae. The blooms block sunlight from reaching underwater life and diminish oxygen levels within the water. Toxins from the blooms may kill off fish and other aquatic animals, make people sick and even kill humans. These toxins are especially dangerous because they can survive purification processes, making tap water unfit to consume once contaminated. Algal blooms also impact industries that rely on the water for businesses and often cause local waterfronts to shut down during blooms. As the climate warms, harmful algal blooms happen more often and become more severe. As the ocean warms, freshwater glaciers around Earth begins to melt at an unsustainable rate, which might result in rising sea levels. The fresh water from the melted glaciers eventually runs into the ocean. With the rising of sea levels, salt water may more easily contaminate underground fresh water bearing rocks called aquifers. A process called desalination removes salt from salt water, but it is a last resort energy-intensive, costly process for places where there are persistent droughts and fresh water is lacking. In the northern hemisphere, where snow, a fresh water source typically accumulates, warmer temperature means less snowfall which leaves less water available in local reservoirs after winter. This negatively impacts farmers who are left without enough water to irrigate their crops in the growing season. There are many things that everyone can do to lessen the impacts of climate change. Some measures include growing your own fruits and vegetables or buying locally grown product, since product is often transported to grocery stores from far away by trucks, which add more carbon dioxide to the atmosphere. You might also walk or ride a bike instead of driving a car. On a larger scale, industries that are dependent on fossil fuels need to make the switch to renewable, cleaner energy sources to influence our planet for the better.